Hey guys, uh, this is a quick match against uh, Synchro Lord or Cinch, whatever you may call him. Um, yeah, I lead off with Breloom. He leads off with Crobat. And since Crobat pretty much walls Breloom, I was forced to switch. And I switched into Heatran, expecting a uh, Brave Bird or something. But instead, he taunts. So I'm forced to switch again because I wanted to set up Self Rocks. And I know this, uh, well, I thought this um, Crobat had a Focus Sash or whatever. So uh, I just switched back to um, Breloom, but then I switched back to, uh, well, he does Super Fang, and I, at that point, I was like, alright, okay, I'm going to just switch back to Heatran, hoping he would uh, Brave Bird me again, but instead, uh, he goes for the Taunt, and yeah, um, so I decided to stay in as he with Heatran, and I Flare Blitz, I mean, not Flare Blitz, but uh, Fire Blast. And I get the burn off, and I just I knew he was gonna switch, but I decided to just continue on with the fire blast, just to see what he will switch into. And uh, he switches into uh, Flygon. And uh, yeah, I was expecting a U-turn or something, but he uses Earthquake. Um, but uh, since Scissor is pretty, you know, bulky, I guess he uh, takes it like a pro. And uh, I was predicting a switch right here, so I went ahead and just pursued it was a good play on my part. I don't know if the crit mattered because uh, this is a choice banded scissor. But uh, yeah. Um, so yeah, he switches into Heatran to counter my scissor. And I switch into uh, uh, Swampert and he Earth Powered, I guess, predicting I would switch into my Heatran, but I don't. Um, so yeah, I just uh, curse up and right here I. I knew he was gonna. Well, I was assuming he would uh, super fang, so I just went ahead for the. Went ahead and waterfalled, but he's uh, roost. And uh, with the curse, it doesn't quite KO since I guess Crobat's pretty bulky. But, um, yeah, it does a lot of damage, I guess. Uh, yeah, right here I went for the curse, assuming he would uh, roost again, but he doesn't. And he goes for the taunt. And, uh, yeah, it was a good play on his part, I guess. And right here, he goes for the super fang. Um, I knew I should have just predicted that. And went, f uh, switch into Gengar or something. Since, uh, this team has a ghost type. Um, but yeah. I just went for the waterfall just in case he would roost again. But, um, yeah, he switches into, uh, Swampert. Which, I guess... It's, uh, yeah, he switches into Swampert to, I don't know, I guess to get a Tossic off, but little did he know I am a Sleep Talker, uh, Swampert, and I really wanted to, uh, get this Taunt off me, so I just continued to Waterfall, and, yeah, Tossic wears me out, and then, um, I went ahead and just, uh, rested, because I knew... I had to get this guy at max HP because he has a uh, Heatran and my team basically gets kicked in the balls with Heatran. Well, yeah. And, uh, yeah, he roars me and it brings out my Breloom and I went ahead and just board just to get a free sleep against somebody and a uh, free switch in. So, uh, yeah, switch into Scizor. Hoping for the hoping he wouldn't you know have that one turn wake up crap and uh... yeah he switches out i u turn get some damage in and um... i think i switched into uh... yeah swamper cause uh... most the swamper is special defensive and uh, pretty much handles anything but uh... he carries hidden power grass which is really suckish i guess for me and, um, yeah, I was just like, crap. He has hidden power. And then I just went ahead and sleep talk just to hope I get waterfalled. And I did get waterfall. And with the torrent boost, it pretty much KOs. And, yeah, I was pretty happy at that point. I was just like, yay. Because I normally rest talk, rest, I mean, sleep talk never, like, goes my way. And, uh, yeah, I decided to go again because... 
sleep lasts for two turns and two turns to sleep talk I guess and I just Swampert just cursed I guess and a waterfall would have uh, broke his sub I guess and um, I would have been able to have a free switch in and KO that guy but yeah sleep talk did not go my way that turn so I just went for Heatran just to break his sub I know it would die or get slept or whatever and uh, he just decides to spore it instead of focus punch I guess uh, to I don't know oh yeah he was I guess he was trying to take down my scissor but I wanted a free switch in anyways and scissor is just the best bet because either if, if he went for the sub I would um, I would U-turn and yeah, you turn into Gengar to take the focus punch if you know, because that's what most uh Bree Looms do on Scizors. And uh yeah, I just went for the hidden power ice to pretty much get some damage in and it doesn't quite KO. I was just really pissed. I was just like crap. And um yeah, right here I uh I go for a shadow wall predicting I know he was gonna switch but I didn't know what to what. So uh I just went for a shadow ball just for a a strong stab move and uh, he switches into a blissey and I'm just like crap I'm gonna rely on my breloom or <laughs> or he trying to take him down with I guess explosion or superpower and uh, yeah I just at this point I just uh, kept he trying in just to uh, explode and I'm just like come on come on he trying just wake up and explode on something so I can get a free switch in and uh yeah he kept sleeping and he wishes to keep uh Breloom healthy and uh yeah he switches into Swampert and um he pretty much I guess I don't know he could have gone for a freaking focus punch I don't know and uh I finally wake up on against the Swampert and I explode and it takes the Swampert down and uh, I'm just like happy as hell and um yeah, I switch into Gengar because I know he would uh, either predict I would switch into uh, my uh, my Breloom to predict he would switch into Blissey, but uh, I just switched into uh, Gengar just to keep it safe. And right here, he uh, I guess over predicts and thinks I would switch into Breloom. I guess I don't know and. Uh, yeah, I just I just go for the hidden power uh, uh, fire just to KO it, and it does, and I was just like yes. And right here I was just like, all right, this is the game. And yeah, uh, at this point he I guess stalls me out a little, but um, I just needed a free switch in, and uh, yeah, I just let him uh, try kill, uh, let him kill my uh, Gengar so I can switch into Breloom and superpower it. But <laughs> he kept wishing and protecting. And so at this point I just switched into Ladia just to get some stealth rock damage on Gengar. <laughs> so I was just killing my own Pokemon just to have a free switch in. And uh, yeah, I switched into Gengar again just to get some stealth rock damage. Yeah, he protects. And right here I go for the focus blast. I don't know. I just I was just really pissed. I was like, all right, he's going to stall me out. And, um, yeah, but instead he goes for the ice, ice beam. He was, he was like, I'm, I'm gonna help you and just kill you, and kill your Gengar. And it pretty much, yeah, the ice beam kills my Gengar. And, uh, yeah, I switch into Breloom. And suck, uh, superpower it. And it pretty much takes the Blissey. Um, uh, so yeah, good game, Cinch. Um, Yes, so guys, rate, comment, subscribe. See you later.